Hi, welcome to RV History Ruling. So we're now in Niagara Falls, but parked at the Niagara Falls KOA, which is in Ontario. We checked in here, and uh, this is also the store. It is a pretty nice store. So now we're just gonna head through and show you what there is to see, all right? So as we come through, they got this nice little thing here, and we're gonna go through and show you on our way back to where I'm parked at. All right, so as you come through the gate right over there, the first thing you're gonna really see, they have two outdoor pools right over here. All right, and there's also a pub and cafe right over there with a patio. How you doing? And if you can look across there, there's an indoor pool as well. How you doing? All right. So I'm going through, and the first thing we're going to pass over here is what they call their deluxe cabins. All right. So there's a few of the deluxe cabins right up front as soon as you come in. And as we walk through, we're going to come around, and I'm going to show you they have a little uh, kids park. So let me go ahead and turn it around and show you. All right, so as you see, we're coming up to where they have this little uh, kids park. There's no pets allowed in that. So just your kids. There's quite a few RV sites around here. All right, so they have two different kinds. They have the gravel and they have the concrete pads. So it's just a luck of the draw of what you get. All right, and as you come around, I will say that their little uh, dog park is a little small compared to the other KOAs we've been to. Actually, a much smaller. So as we come up, you can see where the little dog park is. It's right over here. All right, so we're gonna pause as we move up. Okay, so we've moved up on the side of where that park is for the kids and as you can see it's a pretty big park so if you have your kids bring them let them run around and they also have a bouncy area so if you inclined to bounce with your kids you see like the guy over there they have a lot of things going on they also have some gazebo areas back in there so if you want to do that all right so i'm going to pause as we move around the park a little bit okay so if you're out with your kids and you're trying to get a little snack they got a little area where you can buy stuff over here i think you can also rent bikes and stuff there all right and now we're moving around to where more of the campsites are as i said earlier there's a a large variety of campsites and there's some different type of cabins in the back over here they have some outdoor hammocks sitting area a cornhole place basketball area over there there's some hammocks that you can lay on over there so it's quite a, quite a lot going on again a lot of cabins back there here we got a gentleman hanging out under his, what did you call it earlier? Awning. Yeah, he's hanging out under his awning. Cheers. All right. And we're gonna go ahead and pause till we get around to our area. Okay, so now I'm coming up on where I actually parked. So I'm right over here. Uh, again, full hookups. All the areas have full hookups. Something very important to know about this place. Their water pressure is at 90 PSI, where it's only recommended for 45. So I had to buy a water regulator to put on the, the spout before I could hook up my water hose. Didn't know that at first. And when I hooked up, the water was spurting way too hard. So I went back up and got myself a regulator. <clears throat> this is my little area here. I pulled my table close while I'm uh, trying to do a little bit of cooking. All right, so luckily for me, that building there, that building houses 
uh, the men's and women's bathrooms, the showers, and has a laundry room. And if I turn around, behind that RV there, there's another building, and that one also has bathrooms, showers, and laundry rooms. So, this is, here we are at uh, KOA Holiday, Niagara Falls, and just want to thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe share and like and enjoy yourselves and we'll see you on the road oh before i go though here's some more cabins uh so again there's a lot going on there's some tent areas also but i'm not going to walk up that way right now so we'll see you around thank you